Chloe. And I'm Marjorie. And, and we're, we're from, from Marjorie's Creations. Creations. Welcome to our vlog number five. Five. So, Chloe, how have you been? How's, your, um, how's school going? Pretty good. How's your shoulder, Mom? Oh, thank you for asking, Chloe. <laughs> Um, you know, I've been doing physiotherapy for about a month now, and um, it's good. I can actually like do the right arm. circles, and I've been crocheting. I can crochet for about six hours a day now. The only thing she can't do is she can't do this. No, I can't raise my arm behind my back yet, and it still hurts. Um, but I'm able to do a lot more stuff. Snow. Oh my goodness, the snow. Right now, it. It's actually snowing right now. Yeah, um, and we, we have about this much snow on the ground, and we're probably going to get about that much more. I still can't shovel the walk through with my shoulder. Um, Dad can. But usually what happens is it normally snows, and then it melts, and then it snows, and, and then, then it melts. melts. And then it snows, and it then it snowed. melts, and we only get about that much. And it stayed. And then it snowed. And snowed. Yeah, it just, it, it didn't snowed. melt. It didn't do the normal melting thing. It just, it snowed, and it stayed. So it's been kind of cool. Yes. The only thing about that that hasn't been cool is I don't have ski pants because the ones that I have currently are like from when I was in grade two. So that's three years ago. They are way too small. Yeah, we need to get some new ski pants. I just haven't gotten there yet. Because I we did get new ones last year. They were bright neon green. I love them. And she lost them. At the skating rink. Because I was the kid you could see going all the way around really fast. Oh, we finally took our waterproof camera swimming! We did indeed. It was really cool to actually take a whole bunch of pictures and, and videos. some videos of it. So at the end of the video, we will share our swimming videos with you from our waterproof camera. It's pretty cool. Um... And so since my shoulder is doing better, I've actually, I'm actually gonna be doing, taking nail clients again and with my aesthetics because it's been a while since I've done it for clients. Like I've done my own nails, I've done Chloe's nails and my family, but I'm actually gonna be taking clients again. So we rearranged my craft aesthetics room. Oh, um, and I have a comment on that. If you wanna be one of mom's new clients, and you're in Saskatoon. And you're in Saskatoon. Comment below, and then you can be a client. Mm -hmm. And you can get your pretty nails done. Mm -hmm. um, but while we were moving things around, oh, 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 I oh, oh, can I say it? found Mac Talk. Five rolls of Mac Talk. <laughs> Five. So, so I want you to just guess. Five rolls of Mac Talk plus her and me equals total distraction mm. equals total distraction from cleaning up the room and we ended up mac tacking i've already posted a picture on instagram and facebook well, we ended up desk. mac tacking my the nail desk. desk my nail desk and then we painted it and chloe painted the handles we'll put we'll put some of the video of chloe painting and us doing the mac tacking and painting and stuff at the end too now Acquisitions! Acquisitions. So, I have an acquisition. Oh, ouch. Sorry, sorry. where is it? Uh, here we go. I need to find it for that minute there. Um, so I got some nail polish. Um, so I got this nail polish. I really like it. It's, uh, Sally Hansen. Mm-hmm. And then I got... And she got them for... I got some Joe Fresh. Yeah, she, I got a 15% off. 50. Yeah, no, 50. And then I got um, this sparkly one. This sparkly one. I like okay, it. Okay, turn it the other way because all you can see is the. Yeah, there we go. I like it because um, it's blue and purple, but when you paint it on something, um, it's just like a, an oily nail polish with sparkles in it. So you don't always get the sparkles, but it's still really cool. Yeah, so she got nail polishes with her own money. I got new nail powders oh my goodness these are so cool so they're like the mermaid style one so we can do the chrome we can do the hollow uh the hollow rainbow chromes and the mermaid 
powder, nails. I'm really excited about this whole getting back into nail things, if you can't tell. So we also got, I also got a gift for Micah and Chloe. And... Mom has Micah's eye. Okay, and they are pillows, not just any pillows. <gasps> They're the mermaid pillows or like the sequency pillows where you can like totally draw on them. What I love doing with them is I love um, going like, I love going like that and then making it like a scratch mark. Mine's better with that. You make it completely silver and then draw the heart in red. Oh, okay. You did that. And I'm like, oh, I love it. They're really fun to actually just like sit and play with. Oh, uh, one thing about them. you can, If you have them on the sequiny side, you can sleep with it, but just don't drag your head down because it hurts. Yeah. So we got, and you sleep on the soft side so like this. I bought these from my friend, um, all the little details. Um, she's also the friend who I got to make the... Um, Star Wars mugs. <laughs> Just throw it over there. Okay. Ooh, ooh. I have another acquisition. Paints and canvases. So I got these canvases. They're just the really thin ones with like the piece of board with the paper on it. Yeah. So not too special, but I like them. And I got new nail, not nail brushes. Um, new paint brushes. Paint brushes. Um, and we got some new paints as well, and Chloe's been painting a lot lately. And she'll show you some of her work when we get to finished projects. Yes, and um, I love painting, and Mom just told me, because we went to the store, I'm like, I need more canvases because I'm out, I just want to paint some more pictures, right? She's like, yeah, and then maybe you can sell them at the craft fair we're doing later. And I'm like, I can? You think I'm a good enough painter that I can sell my work? And she's like, yes, yes you can. I'm like, oh! Finally, this day has arrived. I've been waiting for it. Um, awesome. Totally awesome. I actually have a couple of acquisitions. This is my project bag from Lily of Nordic Stitches. It was on our last mail day and I love it. I've actually got my sock, my socks in here. Our socks. Yes. Um, and then I also, you didn't get another bag, man. you've had that bag for years. No, I didn't get another bag, but What's... I bought <gasps> another set of knitting needles because, okay, so I was out walking around with the kids and we were doing grocery shopping and I brought my horrible little knitting bag that has my dishcloths in it. I was knitting them on straight kneading needles. And I lost one. It fell out of the bottom of the bag. So I had an excuse. I had to go buy another set. And I decided to buy the round ones, the Chayagu again, because I've actually Chayagu. really am loving these. I got these from our local yarn shop, Prairie Lily Knitting. And um, they are a doo -doo -doo size four or a 3.5 millimeter and she 60 centimeters. I do have my crochet hook in there. That's, yeah, in case she, I, she, that's in case I drop a stitch and then I can just like hook it back up. So I'm really excited about new knitting needles. Oh my goodness. They are really great knitting needles. That's all we have for acquisitions. Yeah. Not a lot of yarn stuff. Finished projects! Finished projects. So I finished making that honeycomb baby blanket that I made um, for my friend's baby. Nana has finished that embroidered cat blanket that she was working on. For me! For you? It's yours? I started it, remember? Oh! And right. I got bored of it. Right! Oh my goodness! That's when I was first started sewing. Uh, Mom bought me this embroidery stuff six cats to make a blanket. I didn't, I didn't actually buy it for you. Um, one of the ladies at the knitting group from Prairie Lily Knitting actually gave me those panels. Oh, and so, to use. yeah, and so then I wanted, so I was using them like, yay! And then later I'm like, oh, I don't like this anymore, this is boring. And then Anna's like, hey, 
I have nothing to work on, nothing to work on. And I'm like, use this. And she's like, oh, okay. So she finished it for me. She, she tried to make every cat look like a real cat. Um, so my husband is, I don't know, I guess our favorite saying is the shoemaker's kids go to school in bare feet. Because whenever he asks for something or the kids ask for something, I'm like, no, I can't because I've got this order and I've got this order and then I've got to do this and then I've got to do this. And I never seem to get around to doing things. So my husband technically has been waiting for a new toque for like three years. And finally he's like, okay, I need a new toque. Need it, need it, need it. And I'm like, okay, what do you want? And he's like, I want a Viking helmet. <laughs> Doesn't he look awesome in it? He looks really great in it. And yeah, he looks really awesome. So I made them the, the Viking beard toque. And then I also made him the, the little bobble toque to go with it. Cause I mean the Viking helmet or like the Viking beard is just, it's a bit much, right? It's over exaggerated. That's something you'd wear to like a craft show or just for fun to be like, I'm awesome. What of the Comic Con? Oh yeah. Yeah. But the, the little one is more for, hey, I'm going to work. I so Chloe has been painting a lot. She's done a couple of different paintings. And she did this one here. This was the first one she did. Um, and it was for me. I painted some blue and then I put pinks and purples all over it. And then I, uh, with silver, I wrote her favorite scripture on it. And, and, it, and it reads, and he will wipe out every tear from their eye. And death will be no more, neither will mourning, nor outcry, nor pain be any more. The former things have passed away. And that's from Revelation 21 and 4. It was, it's my favorite thing, and so I have it up on my wall just for, like, when I'm feeling sad, I can just look up at the top of my roof and see that scripture. Okay, show that one. Okay. And then, with a big, huge canvas, I made stars underway. Stars underway, and so it's kind of like a little galaxy, and she sparkled it up. And, yeah, yeah. And, and then I made this one. It's called Melty Moods from Chloe to Mummy. And so what is... I did is I painted my thing dark blue, and then I painted it pink and purple and colorful, and then I took I started taking my my colors and going like <laughs> this. <laughs> like three times with this way. Sorry. And like it was going like this and I shaped it so it would be like that and then like go down and kind of meet up back up here mm -hmm. kind of like a leaf. And then I... Micah was also Micah was also down here painting with us. And then he spilt my colors on it and I'm like okay. And he... Artist works with what she's got. And she picked it up so she picked it up to get it out of the way and it ended up just like melting and like dripping down because, because and was, what he did was, was beautiful he spilt in my co my colors more on it and then spilt his water a couple minutes later so i picked up the water and it was still kind of drying picked up the water and then all melted i really like this spot right here it is got a beautiful marbling effect to it and then she ended up taking our glitter spray i used the last we used, we used the last of the glitter spray on this one, but that's okay. We're gonna get some more. And we totally glitter bombed <laughs> with the glitter spray and my lamp and the handles for my nail desk. <laughs> so, oh. so those were all just acrylics um, on those were all just acrylic on canvas. Mm -hmm. um, so this one I actually finished before we did our last vlog. But I couldn't post it because it was a gift for somebody. So I finally have given it to them. And here it is. Look, I made a small moon. That's no moon. <laughs> yeah, it's actually a Death Star. And um, normally when I take photos, uh, it's Quinto who photo bombs my photos. But this time it was Sissy. So it was really, really strange. Because it's my blanket. Maybe because I took it in your room instead of in my room. And on my blanket. Yeah, I took it on your blanket instead of on my blanket. She likes my blanket. Now, I'm really excited about this last one. I finished. Finally, finally finished. <gasps> the modified log cabin. Look at this. And it's huge. Okay, here, I'll put up a picture of it because this is just way too big to like actually do anything. 
But yeah, so I finished that one. So is this, this is for the blanket lady. So she ordered four blankets this year. So mom did the first two, which were the two willow squares. And then I did this one. And that moves us on into whips. Whips. Works in progress. Whips. So I started working on her last blanket. So it's the number four. And it's called The Dearly Beloved. And it's actually by My Sweet Potato 3. It starts off with the border first. And so this is the short panel of one of the borders. It kind of looks like DNA. I suppose it kind of does. But it's really neat. It's very beautiful stitches. Or like, or like and if you only had that, it would be glasses. I suppose so too, <laughs> but you're just crazy. But it's very beautiful textures and um, it's beautiful texture and it's so soft. Um, I'm using the Lionheart yarns of the Heartland and it is color 125 Mammoth Cave. So that's, except I started, so I did all the outside edging and the borders and then I started the middle. Yeah. So it's going to look like a deer and this is how far I got. And I ran out of yarn. So I ran out of it yesterday and we went to go to Michael's where I bought the yarn from and they didn't have any. So I'm like, oh my goodness. No. But I'm going to keep checking back every couple of days and hopefully they have it. I don't know if I was at this point last time, but with the Chloe blanket, Princess Chloe blanket, I now have got 14 rows on. So yeah, so that's all I have going on for Works and Project right now. I'm just working on the dish clouds and because they're just an easy go project. I've also picked up a making some more of the newsboy bobble toques or the women's peaked caps because I've got a couple orders for those. Yeah, that's all I've got for works in progress. Not, not too many this time, which is good. <laughs> hey, I have some works in progress. Mm. Your paintings. My paintings. <laughs> My paintings have been in every single one. Works in progress, acquisitions, uh, finished projects. Can you go grab the one I'm working on? Here it is. So Chloe's been working on this one. She worked on it for a couple of times here. And how are you gonna finish it? Do you know? Yeah, I do. Uh, this was just an idea that I was trying, but I think I wanna change it up. You show me what you're gonna do with it. Okay, so, cause you can see the shadow. So what I was thinking, cause it, it was supposed to look like it was staggering up with colors, but that ended up not really working cause I kept spilling it over onto the other colors. And I made this too big, but it's way bigger than that. So what I'm gonna do, is I'm going to paint over it with that color, the color of blue. <laughs> oh really? You're not going to continue with the squares? No. Oh why not? Because I don't want to. And so I'm going to paint over it with that color. With the blue? Yes, with the dark blue. And then I am going to... Probably going to... Stop. I'm trying to show them. I'm, I'm probably going to like do some like a column here with something in it. And then like two other. You don't know that works. But then no, I like the columns the other way. I like it this way. Could you the co a column of this color, a column of that color, a column of that color, and then kind of make it like take this color. So if I put light purple, dark purple, and a pink, like kind of mix it together, and it'll be good. Take that one, put it on this one, and like that will be really cool. I can't wait to see the finished product. today. Yep. It's really shorter than normal. We've had ones that have been much longer. Well, we still have to add all the rest of the stuff in. So I hope you guys enjoy watching our swimming and whatever other videos that we have to put on the end here because I can't remember off the top of my head. Yeah. So thanks so much you guys for watching our video and as always like, like and subscribe, subscribe and you'll, you'll see us on, on the next video. video. Bye. You might have a mom, she might be fun But ain't nobody got a mom like mine The love's to the end, she's my best friend But ain't nobody got a mom like mine You might have a mom, she might be fun But ain't nobody got a mom like mine The love's to the end, she's my best friend
She's my best friend Cause ain't nobody got a mom like mine She loves me to the moon and back Which is funny cause I've said that forever and ever Before this song even came out <laughs> Very pretty. Now what are you doing? I'm putting glitter on it to make it look kind of like a galaxy almost. That's what I'm going for here. Like a solar system or something like that. Mmm. Then are you going to draw a little blue box? Why not? Because it's not Oh, I think it's quite funny. We are not amused. We are not amused. Are you my mommy? That's awesome. I can see the glitter in the camera. You're recording this? We're cleaning up the craft room and we were moving the desks around and then we came along to MacTac. Just guess what the MacTac happened. Okay, so what happened was that. That happened. We MacTac up the desk. This is my nail desk. I wanted to change around my craft room and have the nail desk over on this wall. And on that wall. Yeah, so it ended up happening that um, I found my Mac Tech and was like, oh, I should Mac Tech my desk. So I Mac Tech my desk instead of finishing cleaning up. And this is how the, the state of the room. So it's a little messy again, I know. Um, I mean, I'm sorry, these aren't my pajamas. This is my work uniform. <laughs> Drawer handles. Drawer handles. And we're going to use black paint. Twenty minutes later. <laughs> Ten hours of painting. <laughs> Seven hundred days later. One million light years later. Light years? <laughs> That's what I said. One million light years. You were watching too much Doctor Who. Oh. 
I'm gonna use my glitter spray. I've only got one hand. visit the library. I usually sit right here and I need to crochet and make sure I have some stuff. But we went to the grocery store first and I just found out that I have a hole in the bottom of my bed. And I'm missing one of my knitting needles. Micah. sensitive color.
just wait! No, 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 it was good. It was better where it was. That's good. Scooch yourself that way. Okay. Your hand is covering the. Oh. Well, then. No, but we put up 10, so 15. <laughs> no. 10 pieces? It's... Yeah, because you put up 5 and I put up 10. That makes 15, so it's episode 15. No, it's focusing on your face. There we go. No, my face. They can't see it, Mom. And she she also, she got this Chaya Goo, um, what's it called? It's not Crochet no. hook. Chloe. Except it's totally not Kaya Chu. Okay. And then and this then one. She uh, made... I I totally knocked it. Okay, is it still in focus? My colors. And going like <laughs> this. You almost whacked it like three times with this one. Sorry. I think you went like 12 or 10 in the last video or something. Quit farting. It stinks. I didn't fart. I didn't fart. It stinks. I didn't fart. I didn't fart. Well, I didn't fart. So yeah, so that's all I have going on for works and project right now. I'm just working on the knitting. I'm probably gonna pick up. I'm picking up. Um. Probably. Stop. <laughs>